So there is a game, a fan-made game, that was made recently. This game just came out. I think it came out yesterday, maybe the day before. I saw trailers for it and I was like, that's so cool. This is Portal Reloaded. This is a game, a fan-made game that introduces a third portal, a time element to these portals. We'll go through it in the tutorial in just a sec. But this is a game that just absolutely blew my mind. The, the way it works is there's the usual blue and orange portals. They make a go in one, you come out the other. Yeah, you know this? There's then a third portal that can pop up, which is rectangular and takes you into the same room, but distant into the future. It's, it's, a, it's a time traveling portal. If you move a block in the past or in the present, I guess, it will appear moved in the future. In the reverse though, if you move the future block, it doesn't affect the past block because you know, it was always gonna be there. You can do some funky stuff with this fourth dimension of time as well. It is going to melt my mind and I am super into playing it personally. <sighs> I, I'm already processed a few things that can happen in my, I'm trying to logic it together. I'll explain it as we get Hello. to like a test. test. Subject. Four, five, zero, nine. Hello. You have, been, you have been selected to take part in a very special testing course. Ooh. That one's missing. Why is that one missing? Is that me? Is that my slot? No, actually there's several like that, huh? That the testing ahead may result in slight cases of sore throat or getting there already. Vision. Or love that. Death. <sighs> Great. So I have played all of Portal 1 and all of Portal 2. Haven't played co-op because I hadn't had a friend. Almost played it with uh, Kerry the other day though. Too. But I am very familiar with the Portal puzzles. I remember them all off by heart. I'm really, I like to think at least, I'm really good at Portal. We will see. <laughs> we will see how far my brain can logically stretch. Ooh. Off we go. Well, oh. to the Enrichment Center. These automated messages will guide you through your test today. The door in front of you is programmed to open in approximately... What? Years. Uh. This test can be solved in two different ways. Ah. Uh. Wait patiently. Sorry, I'm reading ahead. Option two. Time travel to the future. The time portal will open and testing will begin in three, two, one. I love the way they introduced this. It's open in 20 years time. That's cool. This is indeed the time travel portal. Takes you to the exact same room, so it's a mirror. Sensors indicate that you have oh. not yet stepped through the time portal. Sorry, I wanted to, you know, look, I, I wanted to explain in case, you know, people are just popping in. I'm sorry. <sighs> okay, no more dialogue for me. Let's do this. Welcome to the future. Let's get going. What is going? Find a way out. Okay. Don't drink the water. Okay. Oh, look at that. Oh, sorry. I'm just enjoying seeing Portal 2 new again, you know? Surprise, surprise. It's another time travel bit. Oh. Welcome back to the present. If you are ever unsure which timeline you're in, simply observe your environment. Ah, okay. Yeah, use my eyes. Always look a bit cleaner than the future. How does he know that? So they purposefully made it messy in here, you know? Also, his voice sounds exactly the same. I would have thought it'd be distorted. Well, maybe not. Maybe it's fine. Also, what's messing with my mind a little bit is the fact that you, like, this could go anywhere and it takes you to the same place. I would have thought, like, logically I'd end up at a different wall, but I'm not. I'm in the same wall, even though there's... Oh, there is divots. Okay, never mind. Okay, sorry. Still processing. Anything else to say? Anything else going on? This Aperture Science Test Subject Teleportation Device will dematerialize your body Ooh. and oh. rematerialize it in the next chamber. This oh. process is absolutely safe. That is horrifying. Usually. But okay. All right. Teleport me, baby. Oh, God. <sighs> I'm loving that it's new. I love that it's new. These next chambers will involve cube and button-based testing with the perks Ooh. of time travel. Ooh. Okie dokie. That's exactly how they phrased it in the first. Button and a cube. 
testing or whatever it was he just said. In the present, will appear in the same position in the future. Right. Are you guys familiar with this mechanic? Oh, it's mirrored. Oh, that's gonna really mess with me. I want it to be there. So yes. Moving a cube in the present will automatically update the location of the same cube in the future. All right. It pops into existence when you do that. Okay. Ooh. Okay, that's nothing. Right. Can I bring you I in? Try, but no. A present cube to the future violates the laws of causality and is therefore impossible. Right. Okay. Don't get hit on the head. Oh, it's there. And if I'm here, this future version of the cube can be moved freely without affecting its counterpart in the present. Right. So here, I can't ever put a button, a cube here, just because I can't get this one through there and I can't get the other one through there. But I can put this cube on the other side automatically and it passes through the Emancipation Grill. Right? That simple? That simple. Is there not a button here to deal with? There is. Right. Is there only one? Oh, it's only one button. I don't have to press both buttons. Good. Please continue to the next chamber. Is that button impossible? This cube cannot go there, and neither can the other unless I go through the Emancipation Grill. So there is impossible places in this reality. I guess. Okay. I think. Maybe I was wrong. There was a secret e e like ending if I did that correctly, but we'll find out. Oh god, okay, I don't know this bit, so I okay. <sighs> Pressure is on. So, let's process this. We need to press both buttons to make the door open. We have cube in the future, so I, c I shouldn't really interact with it yet, because I should interact with the past first. We'll call this the past. Where it's cleaner, I'm looking the same way again, and again there is cube. Gotcha! I know this, so we can move this cube however we want first, and then we move the second cube however we want. Oh, actually, no, 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 that won't work, because although- oh, uh, no, because that doesn't do that. But, I remember this, you can take a future cube into the past. Funky, but the moment I move this it disappears, right? Yeah, it gone. Makes sense. All right. I'm getting this. I know this. I I, I knew that answer quickly. Immediately. I got this. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. Maybe this will be three hours. Okay. So, the goal is press button to make this go down. So we need a cube here. And then up there is... Uh, I don't know what that is. I will find out in a bit. Uh, actually, before I press that, that will make a cube. The cube is still up there. Makes sense. And then exact same thing over there. Gotcha. Okay processing. So, uh, I can fix this in the future. If I put this, because I need to have him there and stay there, I think. I think I have to do this in the in the past first. It's about working out which one goes on which. So that opens that. So I will op I will go to it. Uh, actually, maybe not. Maybe not. Because I can... I still can! It doesn't work here, but it still functions correctly here. So now I can stand on this. And... What is it? It's a button. Oh no. And then it's gonna disappear the moment I do that. Oh no! Okay, I am actually slightly stumped. Um, okay. I, I don't have portals, which is the strangest part. So I want... To be on there with a cube. Let me do it the other way around then. Let's say that, let's just say mission failed this time around. Right, so let's say this time we do it this time, way around. Where the future cube puts it in place. I can't bring the, uh... That doesn't help anything either. Because I can't, like, if I had a portal I'd move the present cube. Which is not an option. So, there has to be more to it. Yes, you've got it. That's how we make it move, because this one does disappear when you do things. Yeah! Funky! Oh! Mario, Mario, thank you for helping me out. I was thinking you can only move a portal if you use the portals, but no, you can make one evaporate itself, and that's the point! You want it to evaporate! Oh!
Okay, maybe it gets a little fun funky. Ooh. Is that a glitch? Am I glitching? No. <laughs> yeah, apparently I was. Okay, that's fun. <sighs> a lot of times with these kind of things, it has to be an observation error. Is a lot of times the things I'm missing, you know? So, give portal. Pass portal is a thing. Okay. And you can change things in the future. So we need a cube to get up there. So we need... That button's been pressed. This one. Ah, to get up there. Interesting. So we need a button. We need a cube to get up there. We need a cube to get up there. So I'm going to bring this future cube wherever it may... Th Wait, is there a cube? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is there no cube? Oh, wait, hold on. Is that different? Yeah. Oh, look at that. The environment's different now. Oh, I'm, like, I'm in love. I'm in love already. Well, let's make a second cube. Now we have access to this. Observations. Goodbye, future cube. I like the past cube more. Okay. Okay, <laughs> I'm excited about this. All right. So now, in the past, I'll do it the past way around. We have that cube. You're in place. Actually, what's the, what's the future one look like? Just for some observation's sake. A button for there and nothing for there. Okay. Okay. So we can fix this. We do need to do it the other way around. So in that case, um... We have you there, so we can grab the future cube to put into the past, into the present. I'm going to use those two words interchangeably. So now, you are in the... I need to boot you up there first. That's where the passing over comes from. Like, it's inaccessible here, but by the time I get the future cube, it will be accessible there. Now, let me make sure I'm making this right. Yes, we need that turned off so that that functions, and then we put it on this button with the ability of disintegration. Okay. <sighs> right, I'm waiting for this to stump me. And now, for the moment you've been waiting for, Aperture Science proudly presents. Ooh, pause for effect. The triple portal device. Oh, the triple. Pick it up. I will do, I will do eventually. <laughs> to pick up the portal device. Hey man, I don't have any hands. I don't even think I have any legs at the moment. I don't even know what represents me. I might be a 2D your image. should be attached to your forearms. Use them to pick up the uh, portal device. Just about, I've only got, you know, I've got, got bandages. So, I mean, they're falling off soon, I'm sure. You know, if your like, hands oh. are not currently attached to your forearms, please exit this testing track immediately and file a formal complaint to the Aperture Science Limb Relocation Program. All right, gotcha. All right, I'm off. I'm off. Sorry, I need a need a little bit of assistance. <laughs> this marvelous oh. device will allow you to place three different portals. Okay. For now, however, to introduce you to the concept of portals in different timelines, the time portals will be placed for you. Cool. Okay. Good stuff. What do we got? A version that a doesn't have placed in the present will appear on the same surface in the future right okay and with this we can now get past the emancipation grill because there wasn't one in the past gotcha but it's going to keep me in the future when i do this okay right a portal placed in the future will not override its existing location in the present Ah, okay. So now there's five portals. One, two, three, four, and then presumably five round the corner in the time portal. Okay. Easy enough. Okay. Oh. Please ignore that. The decay of this facility over the past 20 years may have caused the destruction of some portal surfaces. Oh, Try no. Try to find a way around this. Okay, so I can't do anything here. That has to be done in the past. Which it will stay there. No, it won't. It's different. I don't think this is what they want me to do here. Okay, I don't think I have an option. I'll put this here, just in case. Okay, but it doesn't open. Oh, it's its own. Oh, no. Can I have multiple time portals? Oh, no. So, we now have access to that through the future. This is not an emancipation grill, and that is now available. 
So, where do I want to start? For a start, I will never have access to that. I can't portal any of these, but they will stay here. Okay, so I've got a blue one in there. I wish to go to, where do I wish to go to? <gasps> They're both the same, oh God, okay. I wish to go there, so that in the future, there's a blue one and an, that I can access and an orange one there through the Emancipation Grill. So from here, we have the orange. I'll put it in view of myself in the future, my own timeline future. So with this, oh, and it didn't, oh yes, they're separate. Uh, wait, that's the reality here. Um, let's put that one there and there. Does that affect? Yeah, okay, so the present moves. Yes, again, it's the future one's different. Gotcha, okay. Maybe I shouldn't have done that, now I think about it. Well, uh, we'll make it work. <laughs> we want what? Access to that. How? Do? Why? Let's just do that for now, then. That's moved that. So now we have access, yes. So now, if we go through here, and we have, in the future, this here, we can go back to this platform, Go through the time here, and it will take us to the other version where that is connected to there. You following? <laughs> so now what? We want this. Ah, where if I'm in the future, this is just gone. Yep, there we go. Nice. Nicely done. Okay, I want to jump out that way to go through there at some point. Gotcha. And then jump out there to go through there at some point. Right. Let's start with our hopping, shall we? No, we shan't. Let's have time first. Observe our surroundings a bit, maybe. What's different? Oh, so clean. So lovely. Has anything changed? Oops. I think it's about the same, right? Just cleaner. But okay. Let us make... Do it in the do it in the past, maybe. So we can actually affect both. Beep, boop. This still has an emancipation grill in the future. Okay. Okay. Now we have extra height with which to go. I got it. You play around with the Emancipation Grill. So. Next destination is where? there, which we can do. Ah. Oh, wait, it's not just this simple, is it? No. Maybe it is, maybe it is. And then because we've done that, this stuck around where it was, there and there. Ha ha! We are starting to get more complex. I just, I just, I just glitched. That's not fair. That's really not fair. I was supposed to go flying, but I think the, the engine didn't quite accept that. I think, or I've just made a, a horrible mistake. Yes, it was. It just, it was a little bit glitchy on me. Okay, cool. So now, uh, there's no emancipation grill in the future. Maybe. I have no idea if that's true. So if I put that there, so now, right now, those are there and there. That does still have a... Okay. Is this different? Not sure right now. Anywhere else we can go with this? Doesn't look it. Oh, but we've got extra height to do this, maybe. Hey! It was just the same hit. Alex okay! Man. Now did you know all the essentials. How about shooting some time portals of your own? Oh, sure, we can do that. How bad can it be? I'll give it a good go. So. Button opens that, so we're gonna wanna use that to hoik out. Also, future t uh, car cube, that's fine. Not useful right now, because we can get a past cube. Wow, hello, that was a slidey boy. With this, we can put you on the cube, on the button, so that you in the past can have that. But, and I can take you into the past. However, 
I don't just do this, do I? It's more than that. It is. I think. Why? Because of something. That you can ah. only place time portals on surfaces which are in the same condition in both timelines. Right, I see. I'll just make it so. Thank you, Mr. Robot Dude. So now, this is gonna get funky. So now, if I hop from there to there, I get the extra height, I go through, I teleport out the same thing, I, like, I make momentum out of nothing in another timeline to go up there. Right? Hoop! There it is. There it is. What's... But we need both buttons. Ah. Okay. We're in the future. We can do what we want here. So. Give me this. Oh, no. We need to do it in the in the past first. Because then that will move the cube in the present. In the future. So now we've got that. Go to the future. The cube's already there. And then we put them in the same place. Whew. Ah, whatever. Well done. Traveling through a time portal will also transfer your current momentum into the other timeline. I figured it would. Ah! Imagine that. I'm so smart I get to do all these puzzles easily and then I immediately die at the first opportunity from a lack of coordination. Now that's poetic. Stand on button we might need to do. Okay. Let's do some observation first. So there's that's the exit which is already open? It is. Because that is active. What is that? I can't see what it is. A button? Button lands there. There's a put button there later. Okay, you do that. It will maybe activate this. Which gives us a ability to propel that way. I bet i got to put a time portal there later to propel that way. But we're not there yet. Oh, ah. Ooh, that's where I get my momentum to shoot myself that way. Okay. So, stairway to heaven. Destroys out. All portals are gone. Propel. Yep. Stand on button. Just something we'd have to do. Okay. Okay. Uh, time is not manipulated when you do this. So we need to... Uh, I could take the past cube here. Go through the... Let's do that. Oh, although that deletes things. And it does delete cubes as well. Okay. Does the future have that? I feel like it maybe it doesn't. Does the future have, oops, emancipation grills? If not, that's our answer, partially. No, it still has emancipation grills. That's uh, typical, okay. But we could do what we want in here. It will only delete the future portals if we do it here. So we do want to do it here. Because here I can do this and um, from here, what do I get? What do I have access to? Not a whole bunch. But I can keep the... I can't keep the cube here. I can't bring the cube here. We need a way to have a cube. We definitely need a cube on there. That is the thing. We And there should be a way to do it. Because we need that button pressed so that that is out permanently. Um, or, yeah. So then we can propel out one way or another. That would be an easy way to do it. Um... Just make the cubes propel constantly. That is doable. Not when I moved that one. That was I, I moved the wrong one. So here's a second idea. Set up this system already for the cubes to be messed around with. I'll just do it in the future this time around. We have that there and that there. Permanently falling for us to then, whenever we feel like it. Boop. Grab it through momentum. Hey. Why do I do it with the future cube? I don't know. Um, I really should have done this with the past cube now I think about it. Then I could actually keep that. Yeah, it doesn't work this way around. All right, well, we'll do the same thing in the past, in the present, in the whatever you want to call it. But I think I cracked it. So, because if we do it this way around, we can, in fact, use... Hello! the time portal on that one because the future cube will have been made in that same plot so that we can do that however we wish. Now the issue is we need to get in there, which is not really an issue. Whoop!
Come on, get it. There we go. Fan. Almost tastic. Okay. Well, I made it here. What? What do we need pressed? We need that one off. So then we need to do this in. We do need to do this in the future. Futures. Fu we need to do this in the future so that that can disappear. Or we just make it move. Can we make it move? I don't think we can. Okay. We've almost got it. Damn it. Woohoo! So now, because we're in the future, we can move the cube somehow. Actually, no, we still can't. Ah. What if we don't do it with the past cube? We only do it with the future cube. If I can even <laughs> do this right. That way, we can have that next to us so we can move it. That will delete the one in the future. We don't need both cubes to do it, right? Oh, we do need both cubes to do it. To make that accessible. So. That is now... Fi oh, wait, is it... Uh, no, because that still doesn't fix things. Not properly. Oh, I can jump off here. So that's how they wanted me to do this. So there... It yes. I got that. Is there anything portable here? No, of course not. Have it fixed in that one. Do it the other way around. Okay. We're doing it the other way around. <laughs> Haven't said it enough. Um, break it. Just break it. Fine. Go to here. Get it done in this reality. I feel sorry for Bernie who has to watch all this. Maybe he skipped it. He's probably skipped it. <laughs> Poor editor. What if I do indeed have... I don't need both. So I will just put this one up there. That is a fine thing to do. It is that simple, because I don't need both. So, with that, we now go into the future. Move the future cube into its correct position. I plug you there and you there, so that I can, in fact, use you as a way to get this. You are now available for me to skip and hop jump through, but I can't do that because the other one is there. Ah! You are correct. I am here. I just need to delete you somehow. I can do that if I... Oh! Oh, it's not that simple, is it? Please don't tell me it's that simple. It is. There it is. Bring them both to the same timeline. Not they have to be on at the same... It's all because I thought at the beginning they both need to be open so I can do that. Which I don't need to do. I don't need to put that on there. But now, because they're in the same timeline, I can have that open while I disintegrate that cube. That was easy. I'm so disappointed I couldn't get that. That's going to be the theme. I think that's what always happens with portal things. It's like, Nicely ah. Done. Now, let's move on to some more advanced challenges. Let's move on to some more advanced challenges uh, next time. But hopefully, <laughs> that took that so long. Hopefully next time we can finish the other half of this game. I, I feel like we're not even like a third of the way in. We got so much. This is still the tutorial. I hope you enjoyed anyway. But uh, that is all of us done for this week. I shall see you again in a week's time. But for now, have a good week, everybody. Hopefully it won't be too dramatic in the world. I'll keep I'll, I'm doing my thing, making notes, making YouTube videos. I'll see you back here, same time, same day, 8 p.m. UK time. Otherwise, my name's been Daz. You didn't really care. Maybe, maybe we will do some other things on the side next week. I haven't decided yet. We'll see how it is. But otherwise, that is all there is to say. See you next week. Bye-bye.